Create an Alexa skill for blind people. Let's start by introduction. Amazon's Alexa devices are changing the lives of millions of people, including those who are blind or visually impaired. Today we're going to be talking about the Amazon Echo and how a blind person can use and interact with Alexa. How can Alexa help blind and visually impaired people? Because Alexa is a voice-activated tool, those who are blind or visually impaired can use its benefits, such as searching and getting information. Controlling the lights. Also, they can making phone calls with Alexa. And reading books. In other side, cooking and shopping. And finding out the date and time. Listening to the radio, we have more other benefits such as checking the weather, getting the latest news, purchasing items from product history, playing accessible game. Let me show you a demo skill for visually impaired people, whether it is for those with low vision or complete loss of vision. Generally people who are suffering from cognitive decline and blind people might have trouble understanding what Alexa says when they ask the time. For example it's 7 in the evening at 7 p.m. and they get too confused with Alexam and p.m. so they think it's time to wake up in the morning. To solve this issues, we'll create an Alexa skill that can provide those people with the ability to track time in different parts of the day and feel more independent. For this skill, the only prerequisites required are an Alexa developer account and some basic understanding of Python. The first step is to log in to your Alexa developer account. Following this, click on the Create Skill option. Next, you'll have to configure some basic settings of your skill as follows. Step 1. Give the skill a name. For example, clock skill. Step 2. Select the language in which you want to build the skill. In our case, we choose English, US. Step 3. Choose the custom model for our skill. Step 4. Select Alexa hosted, Python, as the back-end resource for our skill. Step 5. Choose Start from Scratch and click on Create Skill. In doing so, your custom skill will be created. First, click the Skill Invocation Name option. There, you would be able to modify the Skill Invocation Name. For our skill, we need an intent named Get Time Intent. In order to add the custom intent, click on the Add Intent option and we need to add sample utterances to intent. The get time intent is created in order to display the current time followed with the part of day like, in the morning or afternoon. We need to add some sample utterances which would map to this intent. For example, what time is it, to tell me the time, could I know the time?
Now that we have created our intent, we need to build our model. Click the Build Model option at the top. So, we have successfully completed building the model. Now, let's start coding our model. For this, click on the code option at the top. Next, open the lambda function.py file which is the main code file. Let's start modifying the code. We need to add a class for our custom intent, namely get time intent handler. Next, we modify Alexa's response when user asks for help. Now that we have deployed the model, let's test it out. Click on the test option at the top. Then enable skill testing to development mode. We can say ask clock skill what time is it. And we've got the result. The present time, the present is, 8 time is 8 in the morning. In the morning. We finish by conclusion. That is just a bit of an insight into why the Amazon Echo is great for people with a visual impaired and how some of the features are beneficial for people with sight loss. All in all, there are multiple skills that can make life easier and safer for people who have low vision or are completely blind. In other words, Alexa is much more than just a tool or a luxury item, it can become a vital part of your home.